All right, we're back. Another episode of Eating Outdoors. We're going to show y'all how we breast a turkey uh, after we harvest it. You can, uh, as far as the beard, you can either twist them off or just trim them off. That's Sean's beard right there. Then you find the breastbone right there. Just make a little slit. And then you just stretch and pull. And it will start to tear apart. Expose your breast meat. How many of these you done, Daniel? Oh, probably 40. Oh man, look at them pretty breasts right there. It helps if you dislocate the hips. Like that. Pull all that funky stuff back. Go back to the end of the breast. Get all the meat exposed. Dislocate. And then you just fillet it out like a fish. If Sean keeps his knife sharp. Sean's knife is sharp. We could almost do this fast enough to make a reel on Instagram. 60 seconds 60 or less. 60 second reel. Hey, don't butcher my breast now over a reel. <laughs> <laughs> so where, where do you, where'd you cut right there? Uh, is that just down that bone? Yeah, the breastbone's right okay. there. You just follow it down. You got you. Follow that breastbone down. Does Sean keep his knife sharp? Yeah. Okay. I hadn't dulled it yet either. You see that sack? Kind of want to follow Stay away it. from that? Well, you don't have to. I mean, it's just hot air. It's not going to be like a deer gut. It's just like at Thanksgiving time, huh? That's right. Yep. Carving a turkey. Springtime Thanksgiving. And just like anything else, I don't claim to be a pro. Hold that up and let's see. Let's see how pretty that thing is. Good like lord. Let's see you over this way, son. That's a that's a slab right there. Boneless, skinless. Best thing to do with those, if you're gonna cook them, is marinate them in buttermilk for about 24 hours, and they will tender up. Otherwise, they're actually pretty tough because wild turkeys actually have to use these muscles. Yeah, they do. And get away from Daniel. <laughs> Fly around all day. That would be a hundred fifty dollar processing fee. <laughs> or you can watch our video and do it yourself. Yeah. Once you uh, don't need to worry about keeping your knife sharp, I'm feeling there's like a little knuckle. Pin. You want to leave some of these so you're well. First, you don't want to get blood all over your fan, but you feel a little spot in there. You go above the knuckle? I go right through it. Like I said, it's best to do that last because it will dole out your knife. And then boom, how long you been filming? Five minutes, 45 yeah. seconds? Yeah. Stay tuned for the next video. We'll show you how to get the dark meat. And that's how you breast a turkey in the field and then put it in the cooler and then get back out there to go get you a midday gobbler because that's what we're doing right now. So stay tuned. Like and subscribe if you like what we're doing and uh, stay tuned for the next video.